Boys and girls of the first and second grades, welcome to another Sunday video homily, this time for the fourth Sunday of Lent. When you come this Sunday to Mass with your families, you're going to hear a rather long gospel from St. John. And it tells a story of Jesus in Jerusalem meeting a man who was born blind. This poor man was never able to see from the time that he was born with his eyes. And he was begging by the side of the road because he couldn't have a job. Jesus came up to him and decided to cure him of his blindness. And so Jesus bent down and he took some saliva from his mouth and some dust of the earth and he made a little paste and he smeared it on the man's eyes and he told him to go and wash in a pool of water. And when the man did that, his sight came back. Can you imagine what it would be like to have been born without the ability to see and then suddenly be healed and be able to see things for the very first time. It must have been amazing for this man. But there was a problem. Jesus had performed a miracle, and Jesus' enemies were angry. They didn't like Jesus' miracles because people saw the miracles and they believed in Jesus because of them. And so they began to attack this poor blind man and Jesus as well. And eventually, they threw the man who had been born blind out of the temple so that he was no longer welcome there. But Jesus sought this man out. And he went up to him and he said, Do you believe in the Son of Man? Now that phrase, the Son of Man, was a phrase that Jesus used to refer to himself, that he was the Messiah, the one who was God's Son, who came into the world to save us all from our sins. And the blind man said to Jesus, Who is he? And I will believe in him. And Jesus said, The one speaking with you, I am the man. And the blind man, the man formerly blind, said, I do believe, Lord. And he worshipped Jesus as God. It's a very beautiful story, and it's a true story. There really was a man, and Jesus really did give him his sight. And because of this, the man believed in Jesus and became his follower. It's a good story to remind us of this. There were plenty of people in this story who could see with their eyes, but they couldn't see that Jesus was God. There were plenty of people in the gospel stories who heard Jesus preach with their ears, but they didn't believe him, and so it was like they were deaf. Boys and girls, Jesus teaches us that we always have to have eyes of faith and ears of faith to be able to see Jesus and hear him so that we can believe in him and we can help other people believe in him as well. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Until next time.